Hello world, I'm Mandy Mundo, and this is the Grand Canyon Railway. The train leaves from Williams, Arizona, and it takes about two hours to get to Grand Canyon Historic Village. We got the cheapest tickets available, the Pullman class, which is $70 round trip. I'm here on an Arizona road trip with myself and my friend, Kimberly. Yay! There's a small dining car on board, just your typical snacks, you know, ice cream, chips, I think they had some small sandwiches, so that's about it. This railway first started back in 1901. It had a brief hiatus in the 60s to the 80s due to lack of demand, but in the late 80s there was more funding, more demand, and so it resumed in 1989. And I'll be down to assist if necessary. So here comes the Grand Canyon, folks. Yes, right over there. <gasps> It's just a white. It's just. It's just. A, oh, there it is! Get it! Oh! Did you notice? Did you notice the clouds? <laughs> it's just a white cloud for now. But it's a really cool. So we just walked up a short set of steps past the hotel and heading to the Grand Canyon. <laughs> Get Kimberly's first reaction. We're in the cloud. It's <laughs> We're here with your Arizona weather report. <laughs> it's, turned up, but it's, <laughs> it's supposed to be warmer. Oh, it's, so <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> it's still pretty. Go, Kimberly, go. Oh. We need your genuine reaction. <laughs> oh, I'm sure they are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. So we are going to take a trail, the Bright Angel Trail, where we walk down into the canyon. All right, let's go. Up, 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 up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Amazing! <gasps> it's a natural tunnel. Do not enter dangerous. Look. Oh yeah, I would say that's dangerous. Thank you. Do not enter. But I want to go sit in the hole. Unfortunately, they were doing construction down towards the lower end of the trail, so we had to turn around and go back. But it was a nice little 15 to 20 minute walk down. Kind of connected to this a little bit. You can just go back that way. And uh, walking on the trail. It's like paved. You could do a wheelchair on it, but still, there's spectacular views. Okay. They have like little rock walls. A little one here. You really should go over. Ah! I did it. But you can't go wrong with that. The with the rim, you cannot go wrong. It's at, it's at the top. But it's nothing like. I this. won't go it's any big. further. <laughs> Say cheese. But as far as spending the day. 
if you take a right at the hotel, you can go along the rim trail even more and explore the Grand Canyon as well. Here's the trail, and there's the cliff, and there's the canyon. So strange because it was not blocked off by rope or fence or anything. And there's plenty of other ledges along the way that you can steer off the path and get a closer look. <gasps> there's Kimberly! <laughs> Gonna go further. Ooh. Ain't nothing scar me. Mm -hmm. Perfection. Isn't this awesome? We kept track of our time because you have a total of three hours at the canyon. So once we made this trek to the right hand side, we did about 45 minutes out, 45 minutes back. So we could go and check out the geology museum. Okay, now say cheese. I love it. There's other things to see and do besides the geology museum. There's uh, restaurants in the village, but this was all that we had time for. And you could buy a package where you ride up the train in the morning, stay the night in the hotel, and then take the train on the way back the next day. So then you have even more time. But we did get to check out the visitor center on the way back into the central village. And I grabbed a sandwich at one of the shops for my late lunch on the way back. We enjoyed more entertainment on the way back and watch out because there's even going to be a stick up. <laughs> Arizona road trip and for the next video we're going to Horseshoe Bend.